Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? This is Josh over here at American AF Dumpster Rentals and Investment Properties. I am here at the uh, flip house, and I'm going to give you one last walkthrough before we are completely done. So, as you can see, we have a coming soon sign already for sale, uh, and uh, we've decorated just a little bit outside, just to make it look good. Grass is still looking pretty, uh, pretty poor. But uh, let's go ahead and walk you inside and show you what, what we've done so right, far. So before we go inside, if you are interested in buying this house, there's the realtor's number. We still have to trim up, clean up a little bit over here, um, the flower beds. And we got to pick up this fallen vase over here. With these beautiful flowers. They're fake, by the way. All right, so the front end. Has been done up pretty nice. Got a couple rocking chairs in there. Welcome sign, make it look a little homey. Let's walk around to the back. So, real quick. We're currently walking into what is now, it was the sunroom. However, it's now gonna be the laundry room. As you can see, we gotta still repair that. Uh, it's gonna be the laundry room slash mud room. We're gonna have a dryer vent going out the side there, washer and dryer and then put a little mudroom hanging thing here. This is the official office. Okay. Of course, the only things that are left in this room are gonna be gonna finish the flooring, the trim, the vent, take out that window AC unit, clean up, and then, and then uh, like I said, some trim. Holy moly, we got a big mess here. But this is what we've done so far, check it out. So first of all, you guys saw the wall that went up to here with some little metal stuff or whatever design on the bottom. We decided to get the same kind of wood and go all the way down. Plan is to paint this. We matched the fireplace. We did a whole fireplace. Let's not even go there yet. We did a whole fireplace, top to bottom, floor to ceiling, and then we're gonna paint it to match. We also did a center island to match with that same wood paint to match and the kitchen well the kitchen gives giving us a lot of headache but as you can see we've got all new cabinets I, my goal was to save the cabinets however that did not work out as planned so all new cabinets stove microwave refrigerator backsplash dishwasher all new countertops are coming in they should be in on friday Super excited for that. It is gonna be some really nice quartz, white marble looking countertops. So, and then we gotta refinish, repaint a lot of stuff um, because of the way the cabinets were set up. Our center island is five feet. Five feet with that marble quartz. Trim is pretty much done all the way around. Had to get rid of this water heater or this heater thing here. Trim should be done almost, we'll see. I said we've got some uh, transition strips are going down, which is good. Trim around the doors, which is good. Trim, that does not look good. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do there. It's like uh, holding that down a little bit. Doors are in. Trim is in. Got a window guy coming to replace these windows or the glass because the windows are extremely hard to get right now. Trim door looks like it's trimmed up. Pretty good. We'll paint that to match. Doors are going in. You can see the carpeting. Carpeting looks great. It's gonna need new outlets and new switches all the way around. We'll see what we've done with the master. I'm not sure if we've gotten any closer or farther along with the master. So with the master, we're gonna do the matching uh, countertops from the kitchen, drop in sinks, whatever those are called. We're gonna clean up the bathtub and leave that all the same. Probably paint the wood. So we still have a lot to do. We gotta close that off, that fireplace. But here's where we spent some of our time. So let's go check out the bathroom. So let's 
excited about this one. Check out the bathroom. So we're leveling the floor. It was a big, big, big uh, drop. We're gonna do a small, actually that vein is gonna go over here. That's where the toilet's going, but I'm sure he just needed to move it around. And look at that. Some beautiful tile work going in. Little accent tiles across the top. Really like this. It looks textured, but it's pretty smooth. So I like that a lot. It's pretty nice. And that's gonna be the accent tiles. And finally, last but definitely not least, look at the creepy crawler room. It's no longer there. Oh, let me put a screw there to keep it secure. So let's go from the outside. This was where the garage doors were that weren't functional at all. We decided to knock that whole thing down and we found some interesting things. We also decided not to shed down. So the shed's gone. Creepy crawler room is gone. We have to put some siding, finish that up. Oh, we've got a, some leaking water here, which is odd because the water is actually shut off right now. Not sure how that's on. But, uh, but yeah. So we're gonna have to put some two by fours to, uh, or some four by four posts to kind of level it out. And some siding. And then we're gonna close that off. Basically right here where the roof line goes, we're gonna close that all off and turn that into just one little storage room and that's it. Um, still got a ton of work to do here. Not sure what's going on up there. What's, what's with that? But that's where we're at, guys. Here's the update. Shed gone. Garbage and trash is all gone. New AC unit's painted on, looks like. Awesome, that's always good to see. Probably take some of these pavers and extend them out or add to some pavers. Do something in the little porch area there. That is our update. We have an open house scheduled for nine days from now i believe no today is tuesday the 12th not this saturday but the following saturday so that is the palmer house y'all as always make sure you like subscribe smash the notification bell hope you guys like this next update will be the final update hopefully so that's where we at see you on the next one y'all